lot of weather in the atmosphere is driven by the fact that warm air rises. And there's a lovely demonstration of this that you can try at home. All you need is a tea bag, the sort that comes with a tag attached, um, some matches and a heat proof tile or a plate or anything like that that's, that's heat proof. What you need to do is you need to take the tag off the tea bag and empty the tea out. What you should be left with when you do that is a cylinder of tissue paper. So you open it up and you have a cylinder of tissue paper. Now you probably need to be indoors to do this and it needs to be draft free so no open windows or doors anywhere near. Then you should be able to stand the tea bag up on its end and set fire to it at the top. As a tea bag burns down, there's warm air being generated above it, which is creating a lift effect, and the tea bag's getting lighter as it burns down until eventually it takes off. So, how does this relate to the atmosphere? The motion of the Earth's atmosphere and oceans is driven by thermals, hot air rising. The large scale circulation of the atmosphere redistributes heat from the sunny tropics to the less sunny polar regions. All sorts of weather systems, from land and sea breezes to hurricanes and tornadoes, are the result of warm air rising. You can sometimes see thermals in the atmosphere if you watch birds or gliders being carried upwards or by watching a puffy cumulus cloud billow out.